guys, Marcin and here bringing you another Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle video. And so today we are doing the 200% leader skill showcase for a unit that I know a lot of people want to see get an easy A in part 2. And this is the physical LR Cell and the Cell Juniors. So obviously mine is full level 10 links. He is rainbow. Um, he's an interesting unit. He's definitely aged a little bit. So it's going to be interesting to see what the 200% leader skill does for him. Because remember, with his 12 key super, he does an AoE. So he does colossal damage to all enemies and he recovers 10% HP. So even in events against a single enemy, sometimes it can be useful to do the 12 key super to get the heal. And then his 18 key super raises attack for one turn and does mega colossal damage. I mean, the thing that's fairly common with a lot of these older LRs is if they don't have some kind of defense raising ability on their super attack, then obviously they do age a lot quicker. Because um, when we look at his passive, he literally just gets attack and defense 90% at the start of the turn and then one extra key and 10% attack per existing enemy. So that's it. So his defense is never going to be insanely high. Now, he does have a decent link set, and once we get AGL Cell all the way up to perfect, they have 6 out of 7 links, which obviously, you know, physical cell is an LR, so that's every single link except legendary power. So that is going to be very good. Now, on turn 1, they only share 4 links. One of them is big bad bosses. So to be fair, he is sat at 198k defense. That is with a 40% support on rotation with second form cell. But that is with the fact that, yeah, his passive only gives him 90% defense. And then he just can't get any more. He doesn't raise it on super attack. He doesn't have anything extra in his passive. Like the multiple enemies, he just gets extra attack. So, you know, his defense is never going to be insanely high. But let's go ahead and see the 18 key super. I'm putting him in slot 1 solely for the fact that I'm pretty sure AGL Cell would just one-shot him. And obviously, normally I would not do that, right? You just put AGL Cell in slot 1. But... It's going to take double digit damage from a normal attack. 4.7. I mean, that's not terrible. In so, I mean, well, he's a rainbow summonable LR. So, obviously, compared to nowadays standards, especially with a 200% leader skill. I mean, there's the cell putting up, like, over a million or around a million more. <laughs> not rainbow. Because was that my one or the friend one? Let's see. That was the friend one. I think the friend one's 90%, so close to rainbow. But yeah, for a TUR, I'm putting out a way higher attack stat. I want to flow off the androids here, because they are a defensive support unit, but of course, remember, they are an LR. So they will be giving um, the physical LR cell, when they're in slot 3 on that rotation, uh, he will be getting 7 out of 7 links once the AGL cell is up to perfect. So that will be the best rotation. It means we don't have any attack support, but they, uh, the AGL LR androids do give defensive support. So that's going to be his best turn defensively. And uh, I mentioned it in another video. I'm probably forgetting the order that I'm recording some of these in, but I'm going to start using this new Cell Games Infinite Dragon Ball History stage to showcase certain units. Because obviously when we get to this stage with the Cell Juniors, then we actually have multiple enemies. So hopefully we're going to be able to uh, get the 12 key super and just AOE um, all of the Cell Juniors and see whether that will actually one-shot them. I don't know what kind of attacks that we'll get on the 12 key super, but that could be very interesting. So I'm going to transform up to second form Cell here. Let's see how this affects their links. So still the same four. Because obviously, I think only one of his links changes when he goes to second form anyway. But now we are getting the 40% support from this uh, Jeroen 19. We don't share any extra links with them, so there's no point putting him in the middle and risking Cell getting the kill. And we have 198k defense uh, again. So, Because, yeah, we have a 40% support unit on rotation again. Because we didn't get any extra links. So, yeah, so second form Cell and Jeroen 19 basically giving this uh, LR cell the exact same kind of support. So yeah, up to 5 million now. It's not bad, but again, <laughs> rainbow LR, full level 10 links. Um, but I mean, that's power creep for you, right? I mean, the interesting thing about these 200% showcases is seeing what these older units can look like now. But that's the thing with this physical cell, and it's the reason why he's the top candidate for getting an easy A in part 2, is because he's such a great link partner for the AGL cell, which is what he really needs. In terms of, like, the most difficult content, 
I mean, realistically, at the moment with this Android team, the best link partner for this cell is this second form cell. But especially against, like, the legendary Vegeta event, if we're talking about Global, or the Red Zone, if we're talking about JP, you do not want to be bringing this guy <laughs> in there. Because uh, he will get cooked, especially because mine is only 55%. So even at 55%, he's very, very good. But, you know, he's going to get torn apart by Blue Evolution Vegeta. So this Cell really needs a really strong link partner for him to be, like, the top, you know, tippy top, top tier TUR. Because he is absolutely crazy from his kit and everything. I've seen a lot of people saying over the last few days that they think he's the best, if not one of the best TURs. I mean, he's probably top five, regardless of what you think, but... I would say maybe closer to top three, especially for global, but a lot of people think he's the best. And the only thing that lets that down a little bit is the fact that he doesn't have that really good, really strong link partner for the most difficult content in the game. And so this physical LR cell, he will be just that if he gets an easy A. So, and this is the rotation where we can see our full seven out of seven links. So... We are at 239k defense with the support from the LR androids. Uh, unfortunately, again, considering the fact that his uh, defense can't be raised in any sort of way, that is the best we can do. Um, so let's do this. And then, I guess, yeah, we'll just grab these for you. We're fighting against the super type enemy, so um, the LR androids are going to be a bit beefier on this turn anyway, so they should be fine in the last slot. 8.7 for Cell. <laughs> I mean, this is why this physical cell needs to get an easy A and be super good, right? Because then you can just run this rotation and have these two together. So what is this going to look like here? With our full link set active, 4.7. So obviously, the getting the 40% support from a support unit is a lot more beneficial than, uh, you know, just having legendary power. But <laughs> now that AGL cell is in his perfect form, uh, we will see a very nice turn once we get second form cell, I think, is the... No, it'll be Jerome 19, I think, is the next uh, next time we'll get a 40% support unit. Because I'm leaving STR second form cell on rotation with the other cell. So what do the LR androids take from this? Super attack from Gohan, type disadvantage. Yeah, 230k. <laughs> this is the newest Infinite Dragon Ball history stage at the moment. So some of the stages do actually hit you quite hard. Uh, so ideally what we want to do here is finish... Is the Cell Juniors after this Gohan? Because then this is going to be perfect. Because we're going to finish off Gohan here. And then just go straight into the uh, Cell Juniors. And then get that AoE. And then, yeah, we are going to be in business. So, Cell getting the dodge. And then double digit damage. 7.6. This is my one. This is 55%. 7.6. I mean, he's got 80% support on the rotation. But, 35% uh, chance to crit. Alright, so... It's the only downside to doing this in videos is uh, we have to click the screen 50 million times because it has to tell us all of the abilities of all five of the Cell Juniors. But... Okay, so we have too much support on the rotation, so we can't get the 12 key super. Perfect. <laughs> cool. That's exactly what I wanted. All right, so I guess we just have to hope for an additional. Um, but we are going to be getting a massive attack boost here. Because remember, if we go back into the passive, we are getting, is it 10% extra attack per existing enemy? So obviously on any normal turn in a single enemy event, he's just getting an extra 10% attack. But here he's getting an extra 50% attack. So we might as well go for the uh, full 24 key super. Um, yeah, we've got 10 out of 10 links active. Um, so yeah, I guess that's another downside really. For He links up really well with Cell. But too well. <laughs> Although I guess we do, we are getting key support from the um, the tech cell. But typical, there would be. Uh, I mean, the the LR androids and Jero and nineteen give tech uh, give key support as well. So in fact, on this team build, there would actually be literally no way for them for him to not uh, eighteen key super now. But <laughs> cell gonna get an additional uh, AGL cell. Yeah, I mean, we will absolutely destroy these guys, but it's a little bit unfortunate to not see the AoE. <laughs> if we have any opportunity to get it from this point onwards, I will try to go for it. But 
So 6.3 is pretty decent, but again, that's because he's getting the attack buff from there having been five enemies at the start of the turn. So it's not terrible, but we didn't get the additional, unfortunately, as of course we didn't. Um, all right, so two enemies left. I guess we just do this. So, man, I can't believe that. <laughs> but yeah, that's the uh, the issue because they link up so well, and uh, they do have a couple of key links. That yeah, once you get to uh, perfect cell with the AGL cell, it's going to be a little bit more difficult to get the twelve key super. But as I said earlier on, like the twelve key super is what you want to go for when there are multiple enemies, or sometimes strategically for the heal. But if you're taking him into more difficult content, like if his easy A makes him this exact link partner that we need, you are mostly just going to be going for his 18 key super anyway. So yeah, on this rotation, as long as we can get one key, we actually would be able to get his uh, 12 key super attack. So let's go ahead and see how much damage he is actually going to do then with the 12 key, with support, with all the links active. Just to see what we get out of this AoE. Because then we, we do get a heal as well. 10% heal, which is nice. Because obviously, 9.5, jeez. And yeah, there you go. That's Again, that's why this cell, if he gets an easy A and is good, like this AGL cell just pops off on a rotation with him. Because with the support as well, we're just hitting like 10 mil attack stats. And then the AoE is 3.5. So understandable that it's quite a bit lower. Because obviously it will hit all enemies if there are multiple enemies. Um, but yeah, 3.5 gives you a 10% heal. And then we take double digit damage with the type advantage. We'll throw a level 3 dodge in there. But of course, dodge the normal that would do double digit damage. Take the super. Very typical uh, shenanigans here. 82k despite the uh, type advantage. So yeah, definitely needs to be looking better defensively. I think on his best turn with support, he's like, what was it, just over 200k? Which is obviously nothing too crazy for when it comes to uh, more difficult content. So let's see. Uh, we probably will get one more turn with him here. Unless uh, second form cell just gets absolutely eviscerated by um, Gohan. And we're getting the Dokon attack. I'm not going to hit the nodes. But I've collected all of these physical orbs in the bottom right here. So we can get a, uh, a big old 24 key super with physical cell. So let's not hit any of these nodes. And just get the kill. Well, not get the kill. Get the Dokon attack here. Um, cell, of course, with the 35% chance to crit. That would be a little bit uh, inconvenient. Good. And no additionals as well. Let's go. The one turn where we actually really want Cell to not you know pop off and he didn't so <laughs> good times uh now don't super second form cell that would be pretty awkward still take double digit damage from normals though that's really good and then uh tech cell will be fine in the end even if he gets super attacked because he does have the type advantage um all right good good so full hp uh full link set active yeah, I can't put Cell in slot 1, can I? This is the 90% friend. He's absolutely he's just going to kill if I do that. So we don't get the full link Cell. We don't get Legendary Power. Just because, unfortunately, I can't risk uh, AGL Cell. Because this is the 90% one. Just popping off and uh, ending the run here. So 4.5. Yeah, the that one turn with the extra enemies really made all the difference. Because he needs the attack support, 40% support unit, to break 5 million. So, overall, not crazy impressive, but then again, as I've said, he's a very old summonable LR. So, if he gets an easy A in part two, this team is going to be absolutely disgusting. Like, if he gets an easy A in part two, and you pulled Cell and have the physical LR Cell on global, the red zone is just going to be a joke. Like, you won't even need to summon on the anniversary. Like, you'll already have a team that can beat all the stages, as long as his easy A is good. So, uh... Yeah, that was the physical LR Cell on the 200% team. It's a big shame that we couldn't get the AoE against the Cell Juniors, but um, would it have one-shot them all? Who knows? But obviously in the more difficult content, which is what we really want this guy to get an easy A4, you're probably not going to be doing it that often, but it was, what, 3.5 against one enemy? So we saw the significant jump against multiple enemies. We probably would have been pushing over 4 mil. Which is decent for an AoE, but let me know what you guys think of physical LR cell down below in the comment section. So that is going to be it for the video, guys. This has been the Master Ningen. Smash that like button, subscribe to the channel if you are new. Check out the links down below for the Discord and the merch store, and I will see you all again soon. 
Have a good one.